we have to come to the recognition of evil, that what we need is the art of connection, and our connection is something necessary, crucial. Otherwise, otherwise what we come to is a state where we wither, a person becomes a vegetable. He doesn't need anything. I want to be in some kind of game, and really today there are many such games in which a person can live his entire life. And he goes into his virtual world. He arranges it in a way that's good for him. He limits himself, and by limiting himself, he feels comfortable. He doesn't have to yield to anyone. So why should he connect with others? You're right. By nature, by our own nature, what we're doing is we're studying our own nature now, and we're going with it, we're following it. Everyone wants their small room, bed, computer. Today you don't even need a computer, you have your mobile phone. And that's it, that's all I need. The minimum to eat, I don't even care about that, I don't even want to leave my room. Everything's on my little screen, then why connect? Because there's the general force of nature that won't allow us to enjoy life this way. That after each of us is thoroughly absorbed in his little screen and corner and completely doesn't want to be connected with others. And we go deeper and deeper into it. And we almost drown there. We're integrated in that corner so much that there's no longer someone to get out of that corner and so adhere to it. And I even take the shape of that corner, kind of triangle. Then I start discovering how bad this thing really is. For this, the force of nature, the force of connection has to be revealed, which is called the Creator. And this force shows me what a zero I am, how much I'm losing, that I completely don't exist, but I'm just keeping this primitive law of nature and that I have other abilities and horizons at the reach of my hand. And this period will be called the recognition of evil. And then mankind will start acknowledging that it has to come out of its hiding place, out of this corner, out of their little screens, and that its true, big, correct, broad, infinite development is through connection. And then they will want and look for where are those people that can teach us the art of connection, and they'll discover that these are Kabbalists.